I am dressed a little differently than you are. Um, I'm dressed as a woman we're going to learn about today, Anna Howard Shaw. We want you to remember that name because she was a marvelous person. She made a difference that still affects each of us, especially all the women in the room today. And I'm going to tell the story as if I'm really her. So let's begin. There will be time for questions and answers at the end. I'd love to try to answer them. And we have some pass out things for you too to take home. Okay. It's Valentine's Day. 1847, and you can do the math later. A little girl by the name of Anna Howard Shaw was born in England, and she came into a family that had brothers and sisters, a mom and a dad, and the father had a dream. And after she was about two years old, he decided to leave the family in England and take his sons and go to the United States of America to make a fortune make a better life for his family. So he did. And he was gone for a while, and then he dismissed his family, and he wanted them to come, and he made money. So he sent it across on a, a boat, and they had to buy a ticket and get on a ship and pack things. What would you pack to bring and, not, and leave your home? You can imagine. So the mother and the children got on the ship, and the ship started across I bet you know what ocean, right, the Atlantic Ocean. And they sailed for a few days, and a storm came up. It was a vicious storm, and it, the boat rocked, and, and a lot of people were ill, and the mother was worried for all of them, and they huddled around her a lot, and it got so bad. Some of the masts were breaking, and they decided they needed to turn back to England, and they had to go back for the boat to be repaired before they could come. Well, it got repaired. They started back, but the father had heard about the storm and he didn't think that they survived. But word got to him that the boat was going to land and he was there waiting for them on the dock. And he saw them. And Anna remembers, when she's four years old, her father being so happy. There were tears in his eyes. He picked her up and he threw her up and he caught her and he hugged her. And that became their beginning of their life in America. They went to Massachusetts, which is north of New York, where they came in. And they lived in a town called Lawrence. And there were a lot of people that liked music and theater, and it was a wonderful place. They had a lot of books in the house. One of the first things Anna did was she tried a banana. She'd heard about bananas in England, but she never tasted one. So when she was given one, she bit into it. Oh, it was horrible. And then they explain you have to peel it first. It's one of the first things she learned about when you make a mistake, you learn from it. That's pretty important. Well, Anna, Anna grew up for a while, but then her father had the wonderlust again. Let's move out of this area where there's so many people. Let's go to Michigan. And he and his son got on a train, and they went as far as the train would take them into Michigan. And then it stopped. And they found some land in Green Township, 